relatively quickly, I'd like to explain the difference between ionic and covalent bonds. Ionic bonds are formed when one atom gives up an electron to another atom. One way I was told to remember this is through the cheesy phrase, the names bond, ionic bond, take and not shared. It may help as well to think of the I in ionic as looking like a J. Ionic bonds are based on the electrical attraction of a positively charged atom to a negatively charged atom. As an example, lithium will donate its third electron to another atom, such as chlorine, that is short of a full house. When the electron moves to chlorine, the lithium assumes a positive charge, and chlorine receives a negative charge by picking up one more electron that has positively charged protons. If this reaction occurs while these atoms are in an aqueous solution, the positively charged lithium and the negatively charged chlorine will float around independently of one another. And then on the other hand, we've got covalent bonds, and they are formed when atoms share electrons. The electron actually belongs to both atoms. You could say that covalent bonds are cohabiting, they're sharing space. As an example, hydrogen, as you may recall, is one electron short of a full house. Two hydrogen atoms will share their electrons, forming hydrogen gas, or H2. The hydrogen molecule contains two protons, one per, ox or per hydrogen atom, and two electrons, which are shared equally between the atoms. The molecule is neutrally charged and has a full shell of electrons. Covalent bonds are generally more stable than ionic, especially in an aqueous environment. I hope that you found this video helpful, and if you have any questions, just leave them in the comments below.